Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to be doing a simple get ready with me. It's super hard to film at the moment because of revision. So when I have the chance to like get ready and film at the same time, I'm going to do it. So um, I feel like I have been doing a lot of get ready with me's, but it's just for the meantime, guys. Anyways, we're going to jump straight onto the post notification shout out for today's video. And today's one is going to Thesha Kila. I hope I said that right. Thank you so much for pressing that bell button. I appreciate the love. If you guys want to get featured next time for post notification shout out, all you have to do is obviously subscribe and then press that bell button down below and, and comment when you have done so in the comments below. And then I choose um, people who have just pressed the bell button or people that I've seen support my channel for a very long time and have commented and shown support, you know, very often. It can be anyone. I give everyone a fair chance. I'm going to use this Wonder Kiss lip gloss because my lips are dry this really plumps as well it's like my favorite lip gloss especially to prep for lipstick it just plumps your lips so nicely I'm then going to use some of my origins make a difference cream this is the rich one my skin feels super dry so this is just going to make sure that it's hydrated underneath but it's dry but it will get oily throughout the day and today is like really hot it's 27 degrees today i think i'm going to use some of my body shop skin defense we definitely need spf especially when there's you need it all the time but with this weather you need a lot just make sure you put your spf this one's really good because it doesn't leave that really like tacky feel on the skin which i really don't like i feel like this helps to even out your skin tone right what's next prepped my skin oh we haven't finished actually i'm gonna use some of my my fenty beauty pro filter primer i'm just gonna like put this especially on the center on my nose forehead small lines tap it in okay, so for my base i'm going to be using the nars natural radiant longwear foundation in tahoe and I'm also going to be using it with my Body Shop Lightening Drops. Good shake. I'm just trying to get my right kind of, I think that one's right. Yeah. And I've got my Morphe um, blender here. I'm just going to blend that in. This foundation I haven't worn it in a while but it's so nice beautiful beautiful okay okay I'm gonna go in with my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in Tan Sand which I'm actually running out of I do have another tube and a backup tube actually I think which is crazy I also like to do just to highlight a little bit more is take my Makeup Revolution Conceal and Define Concealer but in C8.5 which is one of their new shades super yellow and I'm just gonna put a dab bit here just to like brighten. And I'm gonna take my Fenty Beauty matchsticks in suede and espresso. I love these. Shade the perimeter, the contour with it. And I'll put a little bit of espresso, it's a little bit darker, a lot darker.
pinching the sponge and just blending all of that in place. you're happy with everything you can now go on to setting I'm going to take my Beauty Bakery flower setting powder in yellow I'm going to take that and bake under the eyes just tap off the excess of your sponge and then bake with it you don't want to put too much like clumpy bits of powder just making sure that this center piece is set because this is where I get like sweaty like on my moustache and everything I think you a lot of you can relate this is why I like this sponge so much you can just really carve that under bit I got this from Jacqueline Hill like I heard it from her like she always uses it to set the forehead the Maybelline Master Bronze Palette and I'm going to grab this shade here I'm using my MAC 135 brush it's so good for bronzer I'm just going to take my powder brush and brush off the excess bronzer just to soften it a bit don't want no line okay I'm gonna use my Huda Beauty um, bronze sands edition highlight palette and I'm gonna use the bronzer shade okay I'm then gonna take my wet sponge and use the cream um, highlight side and just pop a bit on my cheekbones and then I'm gonna take the shade here this is like gonna be my summer go-to palette like I love this palette so much and then I just set that cream highlight with the powder Okay, what are we doing next? What are we doing next? I think that's it. I might pop a little bit of blush. I'm going to use this shade here from the Master Bronze Palette. Just pop For my face, I'm going to use my Smashbox Primer Water. Spritz this all over. Like this is by far my favourite setting spray. Like I've got so I've got so many, but that's the one I always go back to and purchase every single time. I don't really feel like doing much with my eyes. I'm just gonna use the um makeup revolution flawless four palette, grabbing some of this shade right here. I'm just gonna lightly shade the crease. bit underneath as well and this pale banana shade here from the palette I'm just gonna put this one over the lid I'm in with my L'Oreal Miss Baby Roll Mascara no idea what I'm going to be wearing on my lips I feel like lately I have been less into lipstick alright so I'm going to use some of my MAC lip pencil in cork just a little bit
And I'm going to use my Fenty Beauty Gloss Bomb. I feel like I look like a little schoolgirl when I do my hair like this, but it gets oily so quick and I just have to improvise with hairstyles because I just can't keep washing it so often. My hair's gonna fall out. I'm already balding on these areas here. I am absolutely in love with this foundation. I just wish they come out <laughs> with like some more shade. I know they have a really good shade range, but I actually don't have a color in it, which sucks so bad, but the foundation is so nice. Like, look at my skin. If you guys enjoy this little get ready with me, I don't know if it was too boring, but let me know. Some of you some of you guys just like to watch me do my makeup, which is I understand because I love watching other people do their makeup, especially their base. Like I love seeing other people do their base makeup. But yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you want more get ready with me. <laughs> even though I've been doing a lot. Um, thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video and just stopping by. I really appreciate it. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!